calisthenics is so mind blowing as in the skills people do is so beautiful so i think that inspired me also to get into some of it discipline and persistence all you need in life motivation doesn't play a role motivation is just a spark but discipline is what something which keeps that spark alive for a very long time i think fitness is something that you enjoy and stay healthy at the same time you're mentally good as well personally i never rely on motivation i have discipline i think that's what i rely on initially yes you might not see a lot of results but that's the journey right if you give up you will not see results ever but if you keep continuing if you keep pushing yourself stay disciplined no matter what you will see the results i think it started off with a basic pull up and now i'm so into calisthenics that it it literally make gives me goosebumps to even think about how amazing those skills are and i can't wait to learn those skills and then someday yes i think i'll also be able to do a planche everything will come to you in the right time so yeah stay consistent stay disciplined and give your best Hi, I'm Nirmala and I'm 24 years old. I recently graduated uh, in mechanical engineering and also started working as an HR. But somewhere in this I found a lot of interest in gym, fitness, calisthenics. I was always into sports but somewhere I think I started finding that same motivation and same energy in gym as well. I think somewhere I knew I would get into these things because once I left college once everything is done there was nothing which was keeping me fit or healthy and that's when I found gym and calisthenics. This is somewhere giving me a lot of happiness a lot of energy and my entire life changed since. It's great that i found something like this and i really want to women as well as men and every one to know how i feel so even they can get into fitness and they can enjoy and they can feel the way i feel so the whole motive of me the whole thing is to inspire people into getting into fitness to for them to see how this helps them not only mentally but also physically and everything the entire aspect towards life changes as well has different definition for different people some enjoy yoga some enjoy running some enjoy gym some enjoy calisthenics for me personally i found that in gym as well as calisthenics somewhere yeah so i think it doesn't have to be only having muscles or only being skinny it doesn't have to be that doesn't define fitness i think fitness is something that you enjoy and stay healthy at the same time you're mentally good as well For me personally I think I found that happiness and I found that active feeling when I found gym as well when I was calisthenics it oh not only changed me physically but mentally it has given me immense pleasure it's given me immense happiness I know I this is a lot of dopamine there's a lot of happiness when it comes to gym I think so yeah personally fitness is something I think everybody enjoys it's how you stay fit at the same time enjoy the feeling of fitness i think yeah personally that's fitness for me um i mainly specialize in gym uh, calisthenics is something i started since 6 months or 7 months but i think i've made quite a progress and i yeah i'm still yet to learn i think when it comes to gym calisthenics is something which you have to train forever it's not something you just learn in 3 4 months and you can get the best out of it i think there's a long way for me to go learn i'm i just mastered my weighted pull ups recently and i'm still learning uh, muscle up i'm learning front lever i'm learning planche so these are something i am still trying to get the best at it but these are something i'm going to learn and i'm something interested in i'm putting my effort and skill into these things yeah i think gym is something which i'm very i think i've learned most of it there's still a lot of to learn but right now i would say gym is something i'm more in like i have gained more knowledge in when it comes to calisthenics i'm still there to learn and yet to be learning more and yeah i think that's it i think gym was not something which i just uh, saw and decided i think from as a kid i was always into sports i was into running i was into football cricket um, handball basketball i have loads of medals also 
So I think when it came, was about to end, my college was about to end, and I could no longer be a participant in team sport when it comes to athletics. I couldn't take part in it. So I think that's when I uh, sort of missed the chance to stay fit, and I missed the feeling of you know playing and stuff. And uh, that's my, one of my friends said, "Why don't you try gym?" Like I just, I was like, "Sure, let me just go to the gym." And I think, yeah, so it just happened. My journey started there. So I went to gym first one month, and I could feel the same emotion I felt back then in my sports, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. I think since then I have not even thought of going back to any other thing because gym has given me that strength, that happiness which I found back in sports. And when I was tweaking between what kind of athlete I should be, like what gym and this MMA, this gym and this calisthenics, I also found interest in calisthenics with along with gym. Calisthenics is so mind blowing, as in the skills people do is so beautiful. So I think that inspired me also to get into some of it. And yes, I started uh, recently, but I think it's going to stick with me for a very long time. And in fact, for a very very long time, I want to learn all the skills. And yeah, I think these are two things I'm really into it. And my journey has just it's just being life changing, and I'm glad I you know got into it. Personally, love upper body workouts. Um, I know this. People might assume when you're a girl, you usually like leg workout. That's that's also not true. I love, I enjoy upper body workout, especially back day, bicep day, even shoulders. I thoroughly enjoy it. I look forward to these, you know, days when I can hit the upper body. I love back workouts. I love doing pull ups. I have anything to focus on shoulder, biceps. I'm really very excited to go for it, and I. I don't know. I from the time I started seeing a lot of you know difference in my upper body, it makes me feel so confident, and I want to hit it. So like, I want to hit that workout, no matter what. So I really look forward, and it's very exciting. And I think yeah, it I enjoy it a lot. And when I started seeing those small biceps, mini gains, and the shoulder pump and everything, it makes me so excited to you know do it again and again. And yes. Pull up is something I think I struggled for a very long time. I could never do even a single pull up. When I saw people do pull ups, I used to be like, "Wow, that's so beautiful! I bet will I be able to do it?" So now that I've mastered how to do pull ups, when I say mastered, yes, I can do clean pull ups. I can also do 10 kg weighted pull ups. But now, and I think I, in future I'll be able to do much more. But this is something you know I enjoy a lot: pulling my own weight, pulling the excess weight. Seeing those lats coming out and seeing those mini bicep gains, and that's something which you know encourages me. I think a few exercises I would really enjoy is pull-ups first thing, and second thing is lat pull downs and bicep curls, shoulder presses. These are some of my favorites. I enjoy them. I do lower body as well. I do enjoy squats as well. But I'm a you know upper body dominant person. I would love I love doing upper body workouts. I thoroughly enjoy it. Yeah, personally, I love upper body. I think people who had that conception that women only love legs. Here you go. There are people who enjoy, who love upper body workout, especially back workouts. So if you and I ever want to work out, I think back workout will be the day how you can approach me. So we can hit a good back workout, have a wonderful session, and build those lats, build those biceps. Yeah. Perfect. People ask me how I stay consistent with these things. I mean, don't you get bored of gym, and you know you don't see results so quickly? How do you keep yourself motivated? Motivated. Personally, I never rely on motivation. I have discipline. I think that's what I rely on. You don't feel good. Still go to the gym. You can feel good. Go to the gym. There are days when it rains. No excuses. Still hit the gym. I think once you put your mind, heart into something, no matter what comes in between, you need to do. That's what is being disciplined, being persistent. No matter how bad things get, I keep showing up. Even when I'm sick, I take the needed recovery for sure. But once I start feeling good, I'm back to it. Like I don't, I don't prioritize anything over gym personally. It's gym for me. This fitness is important for me. There's nothing. Discipline is all I am dependent on. Persistent. Because initially, yes, you might not see a lot of results, but that's the journey, right? If you give up, you will not see results ever. But if you keep continuing, if you keep pushing yourself, stay disciplined, no matter what, you will see the results. 
and I think uh, first six months of the gym, I also was a little, you know, worried. Oh, I don't see enough muscles. Oh, I don't. I'm not lifting enough weight. I wanted to give up, yes, for sure. But I kept pushing because I know one day I'm gonna see great results, and that's what kept me pushing. And now I'm so happy with that I didn't give up back then. I'm so happy I pushed myself. I'm so glad because. It's life changing. Trust me, if you are starting right now, I think you should really give it some time. Give it a six months, one year. Everybody has it that has their own time. Stay disciplined, stay persistent, do not give up no matter what comes in your way. It's it's okay to take one or two days of rest for sure. Your body needs recovery, but please get back to that journey again. Do not give up. I that's something which has always helped me like i know i would see great results because i'm going to put in the effort time and i'm going to give it my best and that is when i'm going to see good results so yeah discipline and persistence is all you need in life motivation doesn't play a role motivation is just a spark but discipline is what something which keeps that spark alive for a very long time you might feel motivated today you might not feel motivated tomorrow but you know what keeps you moving ahead Discipline, persistent. Keep persisting. If you are going to decide, this is the weight I need to lose. This is the weight I want to gain, or this is the muscle group I'm targeting today. Stick to it, no matter what. Do not give excuses. And this is the mindset which I bought myself up. I have put this in my head that yes, I'm going to do this, and I'm going to stick to it, no matter what. Even if it's the worst or worst situation, I'm going to do it, no matter what. I think this is the drive I have in me. And I think that is why I'm, I am where I am today because of that particular drive itself. Three tips I would give for a beginner who's into getting into either bodybuilding or calisthenics is, yes, please focus on the form. I know when you enter the gym, you might see a lot of people lifting a lot of weights, and it might make you feel intimidated. And you might also try to lift. I don't think I would never, you know, encourage someone to go with heavy weights. Please focus on your form. And please, you know, stick with lightweight. It's okay if your progress is slow. It's okay if you see someone more big than you. This is something which takes a lot of time. And I would say, please don't give up at the same time. Keep pushing yourself. You will do a lot of weights in future. But please focus on the form. Please don't give up. Stay consistent. Stay persistent. And give your best. And also, second tip I would give is focus on your nutrition. You need to eat right. You need to eat well. Do not starve yourself before the gym or after the gym. Do not starve yourself. Please eat well. Eat the right food. It suits your body. Focus on nutrition as well. Yeah, I think this is the second one. And the third one, I would say, is consistency. Your mind. Please keep in head. This is a long process. It won't show you results in a week or two or even a month or even two months and sometimes even six months. But you need to push yourself to go to the gym, stay disciplined, and please don't give up. I'm telling you, you will find amazing results. You will feel so beautiful in your body and your mind will feel so light. All you have to do is stay consistent, stay disciplined, and. Don't let anything say otherwise. People might be like, "Bro, nothing is seen in your body. You not, I don't see much changes." But trust me, give it a year, give it two years, and you see a lot of results. And even in calisthenics, skills are something which are very difficult. Which doesn't just take a day or two to just learn all the skills. It takes a lot of time. But keep pushing, stay disciplined, and give your best no matter what. Eat right, lift right. And everything will come to you in the right time. So yeah, stay consistent, stay disciplined, and give your best. Radio.